پاکستان پیغام 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 Majority of sweeping 
and cleaning jobs are reserved for Christian community. Most of them belong to poor families and they don't have access to a lot of education and job resources. Now let's see what government of Pakistan has tried to handle this issue. And they have tried to make this effort through the quota system. On May 26, 2014, the federal government ordered a directive in which 5% of quota was introduced for our religious minorities. Sindh, Punjab and Blochistan implemented this quota on provincial level also. But on the other hand, KPK first introduced 0.5% and then they increased it to 1%. And in December 2014, they increased it to 3%. On June 19, 2014, the Supreme Court of Pakistan passed a judgment in which it was made compulsory for federal as well as for provincial governments to implement this quota. And in 2015, the Supreme Court of Pakistan also made it compulsory to advertise this quota. Because according to the research, it was found that that although this job quota exists, but due to the communication gap, people are not getting to know about this. And according to Punjab Public Service Commission, 53% of these seats were unfilled. Either the people are unaware of number of vacancies available, or information provided about the job description is wrong. So essentially the problem lies in the fact that this isn't reaching the people it is meant for. This job quota is, is right of our religious minorities. It is the responsibility of our government to widely advertise this quota and it is also the responsibility of our religious minorities to utilize this quota and take benefit from it. Taking care of our vulnerable minority community now will only result in these communities benefiting our own country later on. All non-Muslims should enjoy equal and same rights as we Muslims enjoy in the state of Pakistan. They should have right to life freedom from torture, equal treatment, privacy, marriage, security, freedom to thought and expression. We all should respect and work for the rights of non-Muslims. Only then they can live freely in Pakistan. When majority and minority go hand in hand, our country will be successful. This is the time we all forget our differences and stand together as equal citizens of one state, Pakistan. We all must play an active role in creating and promoting peace, tolerance, coexistence and non-extremist environment. We all must address all type of conflicts with, in a constructive way that encourages reunion and conflict resolution. Let's work together to support our religious minorities so that they can live freely in Pakistan. Thank you. Um, pegham, pegham e Pakistan, pegham, pegham, pegham e Pakistan, pegham.